The chromosomes of all organisms contain regions called genes. Each gene determines a particular trait of the organism. For example, one gene in pea plants determines seed color. Another gene determines seed shape. A diploid cell has two matching sets of chromosomes. Matching pairs of chromosomes are called homologous chromosomes. Homologous chromosomes carry the same genes in the same locations. Since all diploid cells have homologous chromosomes, each cell carries two copies of each gene. However, the two copies are not always identical. The two copies of the gene may specify two different versions of the same trait, seed color for example. One version of the gene on one chromosome may specify green seeds, while the version on the other chromosome may specify yellow seeds. The different versions of a gene are called alleles. The cell also carries two different alleles that determine seed shape. One allele for wrinkled seeds and the other allele for smooth seeds. Now consider what happens in meiosis. The chromosomes replicate. In metaphase one of meiosis, homologous pairs of chromosomes move to the middle of the cell. In anaphase one, the homologous chromosomes are separated and pulled to opposite ends of the cell. Two haploid daughter cells are formed. When the homologous chromosomes were separated, the alleles on those chromosomes were also separated. The allele for yellow seeds is now in the right daughter cell, while the allele for green seeds is in the left daughter cell. This process of allele separation is called segregation. The alleles that determine seed shape have also segregated. The allele for wrinkled seeds is in the left daughter cell, while the allele for smooth seeds is in the right daughter cell.